Let's create this vector on PowerPoint. First open up a black slide on your PowerPoint, then go to insert, then go to shapes and maybe pick this rectangle over here and just drag it out a bit. Done. Then what I'm going to do is just go to shape outline and make no outline so the outlines will disappear and then go to shape field and make this this color maybe. Done. Now for the best part. Go over here, you have a slight dot over here, form a shape, just click on it and a window will pop up. Then go to this option and you have many of these windows. You can just click on this and many options will pop up. What I'm going to do is just X rotation, I'm going to make it 30 and Y rotation, make it 30. So you can see what's the difference. It creates, you know, a perspective, three perspective on the object. Then what I'm going to do is go to depth over here under the 3D format. And I'm gonna increase it. You can see it creates a depth. Now what I'm gonna do is just increase it about maybe a hundred or maybe a thousand. On a thousand is way too much. I guess it would be four hundred. Four hundred would be best, I guess, or three hundred or two hundred. Two hundred fifty. Yep. All right, done. Now I'm just gonna use a bit. All right, done. Then what I'm gonna do is go to this effects option again and here's the main part you have this material option over here and when you have some special effects over here whenever you select this wireframe it automatically creates this 3d effect now you can just increase or decrease the depth to make it wherever the hell you want and you can also change the perspective as you wish as you see fit so you see it creates a 3d art vector art on your powerpoint easily and now for the even better part go to insert again go to shapes again and pick this circle all right uh, suppose you want to do the same thing to this circle again now you don't have to go through the, all the process over here and again you just click on this thing which you have already done Go to home and you have this format painter over here just click on it and then click on this and boom you automatically created this art already that's so easy and that's a fascinating way to create these 3d arts and vector arts in your powerpoint now for the fun part even a bigger bonus just go to insert and i'm gonna pick some random shapes and maybe this triangle maybe uh, this you know parallelogram or maybe this pie chart, where's the pie, where's the pie, yeah, here's the pie, or maybe another shape, I'm just picking on random shapes, uh, maybe this shape, this shape, yep, eardrop, eardrop, and another shape would be awesome, and which shape should I choose, I would choose this moon shape, uh, moon shape, all right, done. now for the magic, just drag, uh, just click on this, go to home and double click on format painter then just click 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 done that's how easily you can make these things on powerpoint just with format painter you can easily change your arts thanks for watching for more of these videos don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to this youtube channel